Welcome to Foglight Video Solutions. This video will cover how to add multiple monitored host agents using the infrastructure cartridge. My name is John Sakalaskis and I am a technical product specialist for the Foglight product. The Add Monitored Host List Wizard allows you to start monitoring multiple hosts in your infrastructure environment. You can launch this wizard from the infrastructure environment dashboard by clicking multiple hosts in the upper right corner. To add a host agent, log into the Foglight console. Change to the expert view. On the infrastructure environment dashboard in the upper right corner, click multiple hosts. The add monitored host list wizard appears with the agent manager page open. Select it to the agent manager to install the new agent on. The infrastructure agent package must already be deployed to the FIGLAM. Ensure the virtual guest checkbox is disabled and click Next. The Add Monitored Host list wizard refreshes, showing the host list page. Specify the host that you want to monitor. You have two options that you can combine depending on the host that you want to start monitoring. Choose Add Known Unmonitored Hosts option if you want to start monitoring one or more hosts that already exist in your environment but are not currently monitored. Choose Add new hosts if you want to start monitoring new hosts that are not currently showing as unmonitored hosts in your environment. In this example, we will add two new hosts. In the enter host names here, one host per line dialog box, type a list of one or more host addresses, one host per line. To specify an override name for the host, type a comma immediately after the host name, followed by the override name, then click add. The host list page refreshes showing the list of hosts that you selected for monitoring. Optionally, you can specify host name overrides for one or more hosts. To specify a name override for a host in the row containing the host in the host name override column, click set override. In the dwell that appears, type name and click save, then click next. The wizard checks whether the selected agent manager has any credentials configured for the selected hosts and displays the findings on the credential verification page that appears. A matching credential has a resource mapping that resolves to a host name. Credentials are security data that provides Foglight for infrastructure agents with the permissions to monitor system resources, such as a host or range of hosts. On the credentials verification page, select one of the following options. Select the Do Not Configure a Credential option if you want to configure a credential for this resource at a later time. Local credentials for Windows and Unix are set up by default when the Foglight for Infrastructure is installed. Select the Add Host to a new credential if you want to add the host to a new credential. This option is suitable if none of the existing credentials have the connection details needed to access the new host. Select Add Host to an existing credential if you want to add the host to an existing credential. This option is suitable if an existing credential has the security data needed to access the new host, but you will need to edit its resource mappings to include this host. If the selected host name matches the host on which the agent manager is running, click Next. In this example, we will create a new credential. On the credential type page that appears, select the credential type from the available options. The options will vary depending on the agent type. Then click Next. In the Credential Properties page, the level of required information depends on the selected credential type. For example, the username and password type needs a username and password, while the challenge response type needs a username along with a question or response pair. Type the required properties and click Next. On the Credential Name and Lockbox page, provide a name to identify the credential and select a lockbox in which you want to keep the credential. A lockbox can be used to group credentials for access and or security. In smaller Foglight installations, using the default system lockbox should be sufficient. Click Next. On the resource mapping page, indicate which hosts you want to associate with this credential. You can either select the host you're about to start monitoring, all monitored hosts, or hosts whose name contains a specific text string. Then click Next. Setting a policy is optional. A policy defines the number of times a credential can be used, the number of allowed authentication failures, the time range during which the credential is valid, or the length of time the credential data can be cached on the client. 
For example, you can specify the number of times a credential can be used or the time period from which it can be used. Click Next. Once a Windows credential has been created, we will repeat the same process for Linux and Unix agents. On the summary page that appears, review the information provided about the host and monitoring agent. To perform a connectivity check, select Check for Connectivity. For a successful installation, an agent has to be created and it must be able to connect to the host it will monitor. The connectivity check is an attempt to establish a connection to the host after the agent has been created. If the connectivity check fails, an error message will be provided. The connectivity check adds approximately one minute to installation. If you choose not to check connectivity, you can verify the agent status on the agent status dashboard. Click Finish. The new hosts are added to the host dashboard after a short delay. The monitoring agents are created. If you perform a connectivity check and verification fails for one or more of the agents, an error message is displayed to help you better understand and resolve the problem. Review the information in the Add Monitored Host dialog box. If applicable, review the error message and perform the necessary steps as instructed. Close the Add Monitored Host dialog box. The agent instances created to monitor the new host appear on the agent status dashboard. Agents created using the Add Monitored Host wizard appear on the agent status dashboard only after clicking the Refresh button. To learn more about Fog Life for Databases, visit us at support.quest.com. For quick support questions, follow us at Quest Experts on Twitter.